So I got a uh, few ground control up and running on my uh, in Ubuntu, which was actually pretty easy. You just have to compile the source code yourself. Uh, but now that I got that running, I'm here in Lee Hill Park, as you can see on the screen. I got a couple coordinates laid down on the map here at the park. I was going to fly through the diamonds, try to find the bases and stuff, but um, as you can see in person in the park, there's actually games going on and people here. So now I'm trying to stay into this field over here, which uh, I was trying to stay away from those trees if I could, but now I'm forced to go over there and hope that this map is accurate in the tree line is cut the same way it is now. So I'm praying it is. So all I have to do at this point is hit takeoff and hopefully it will fly a little bit of a zigzag, go all the way out to this point, which is uh, pretty much out of sight, even with me chasing it and then coming back and landing in the parking lot. So we'll uh, hopefully it'll work and we'll see how it goes. So here we go, takeoff, and we should see the drone react and take off, spin around once, and then go to altitude. Spins around to get the GPS signal. Now it should go up to the three meters and fly on its course. And hopefully I don't hit any of these uh, poles in the area over here. Just by luck, that would could happen. So I think it got to its first waypoint. It's turning and commencing back this way. And indeed it is. I'm going to try to get a little bit closer of a shot as it scoots across the field and out of sight. It's going closer to the trees than I'd like, but maybe that's just my perception. And now it should be, looks like it's heading out. To the far and it's out there it is out there I'm gonna pause the video right now until I can see it start coming back no use for just videotaping shakiness And I could see her coming back. I'm not sure if I got it in the camera frame here. There she is. And holy, she's coming straight back towards me to land. I think.